Well, good afternoon, Chair Vargas, Vice Chair Lawson Reamer, uh, Supervisors Anderson and Desmond. Um, bless you. I understand that this is a thankless job, and I thank you for leading our county during such a time as this. Um, as I have already stated, um, I am uh, going to move forward with whatever you decide today. But I am here today to ask you to vote to hold a special election. I know that there are many different opinions on the matter for many different reasons. Uh, I respect them all, and I understand that this is a nuanced conversation. And it is not an easy decision. But it is my strong belief that the people of, count, of County District 4 need to be heard, especially when it comes to a person who will represent them for three and a half years. Voting is the pillar of our democracy, and to take that away from any resident of the county will have grave consequences in the long term for our region. Part of our job as elected officials is to build trust in a system that many see as broken. And I know that each and every one of you has been working on this for the majority of your careers. I've witnessed it myself. And I know it's particularly hard in this moment, but I ask you not to change course today. One thing that I have had experience with is that the people never win when we're playing insider games. It just doesn't work that way. And so because of that, I understand that there will be a gap in time, unless you choose option three, a gap in time where there is no representation. That is very hard, but I also know that there's a chance that the person sitting in that seat beyond those few months will be a person that doesn't represent the interests of District 4. And so I'm just asking that you take it to the people so that the people can, can decide. Thank you so much.